It's here, the nuclear update video. I'm super excited to watch this with every one of you and share my thoughts. There's a lot to break down here, so don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the commentary. And make sure to check me out live on Twitch, Tuesday through Friday. Let's get started. So right away, you could see that sulfur will remain a crucial component of the nuke process. The sulfur will enter the blender with concrete to somehow create the encased uranium cell. We kind of knew sulfur was stepping away from the refineries, and it's been stated that those machines will be used for oil processes only moving forward. Then we could see the rods and encased beams creating the nuke fuel rod in the manufacturer as before. So that hasn't changed. Nuke plants will still require water and will still output nuclear waste. Now this is the part everyone's been waiting for. The nuke waste mixes with silica, nitrogen gas, and what I'm guessing water here in the new blender machine. This appears to be making some sort of plutonium cake product. Then the cake appears to be mixing with once again more nuke waste, but this time without any sort of liquid. Not only that, but this appears to be a new machine, similar to the blender, but with only one liquid input. I'm curious if this is maybe a Mach 1 blender, whilst the previous machine is Mach 2. I'm not sure. After mixing together, the nuke waste and cake create what appears to be plutonium rods. The plutonium rods will combine with concrete to make encased plutonium cells. Then those plutonium cells are combined with once again more control rods, steel beams, and heat sinks to create the plutonium fuel rods. I'm assuming these plutonium fuel rods will offer two or three times more staying power than the traditional nuclear fuel rods. Finally, you have your plutonium waste. Well, that's it. Only one question remains. What is this mysterious new machine? Or did I make a mistake? Let me know down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I can't wait to see what the rest of Update 4 has in store. Please say Mach 6 belts. Yes, I know it's Mark, okay? I like to see.